You've no doubt seen those TV shows where adults who are not law enforcement pose as kids online to ensnare possible predators in a trap. Well, there are a number of these vigilante groups operating in Pennsylvania, but a recent court ruling suggests they're not legal and suspects are walking free. Dennis Owens reports from the Capitol. They are online and they are looking for kids. We have a problem where 20% of minors have been sexually approached uh, online by predators. To combat the problem, a number of citizens groups and vigilantes have set up stings to lure and catch the would-be predators. But in Pennsylvania, that's now a problem. Judges are saying you actually didn't commit a crime if you're a predator thinking that online you were gonna meet a 15-year-old, you actually meet an adult. Clearfield County Judge Frederick Ammerman recently set a precedent when he tossed a case that relied on one of those third-party stings, saying that the law only allows victims to be an actual minor or law enforcement posing as a minor. We've got to make it possible for these people to be prosecuted. State Rep Jim Gregory, a childhood sex abuse survivor, is introducing a bill that would authorize anyone to pose as a minor to catch online predators. There's the larger issue of whether these these activities not done by law enforcement, done by individual citizens, uh, should occur. The State District Attorneys Association says it respects the motivation of civilian predator hunters, but urges them to report their suspicions to the probes and let them handle it. Because law enforcement officers are trained in this space. They're, they're trained to do these investigations. And from a prosecutor's point of view, we need the evidence to prove the cases. And Gregory expects some people have concerns about the constitutionality, but he says he's a lawmaker. He makes laws. It's up to the folks in black robes to decide whether they pass constitutional muster. And for him, it's personal. I've lived through hell on earth. These young people that are being solicited by these predators are being placed in a place where they can go through hell on earth and we need to change it so that that doesn't happen to them what has happened to people like me. In Harrisburg, Dennis Owens, ABC 27 News.